Hi, I'm Stephen Traw and welcome to the first in a series of videos on drum set therapy for special needs students. This series is designed for special needs educators, parents, and therapists with no prior experience or training necessary on the drum set. Now the use of the hands and the feet together is one of the main advantages to drum set therapy. Whether they're used simultaneously or eventually independently or in combinations of left foot, right hand, left hand, right foot, and even more complex patterns. And the other advantage is that the kids will do this over and over, sometimes for hours, because it's so much fun. I'm really excited this morning because this is the first time I'm going to get to work with 9 to 11 year old special needs students who are mild to moderate in their behaviors. They are Down syndrome and autistic kids who have behaviors that often result in screaming, hitting, running out of the room, uh, stubbornness, refusal to participate. So it's going to be especially interesting to see how effective drum set therapy is in working with these kids. So would you like to play this? Yes. Yeah. Everybody like to play this? Okay. Now you're going to have to play with both hands. Everybody ready? Eight times on your legs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight times clapping. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now eight times with your feet. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So all together, here's what it looks like. Ready on your legs. And one, two, three, four, five, six. Clap your hands. One, two, three, four, five, six. With your feet. One, two, three, four, five, six. Ready, stop. Okay, who thinks they can do this on the drum set? Who wants to come up and try it on the drum set? You do? Okay, you come on up first. Okay, put your feet on the pedals. These pedals move so we can get them just right where you want them to be. Let me move it closer for you. Everybody ready? Yeah! And yeah. here we go. One, two, three, on your legs, now clap. One, two, three, four, five, now with your feet. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Very good. You did a good job, so you get to go second. So now you've seen the first real-world session of drum set therapy, and I hope you can see some of the benefits that this approach provides. 
In future videos, we will reinforce the techniques we started today and add more complexity. Now, one of the advantages to playing the drum set is the fact that you use sticks. And I have found drumsticks to be a much more effective feedback mechanism than just playing with hands. The sticks vibrate, they have a recoil to them, and I find that the students don't get tired using sticks as quickly as they do using their hands. Up until recently, the main obstacle to the incorporation of drum set therapy has been the drum set itself. Drum sets tend to be large, bulky, loud, hard to maintain, and expensive. However, with the development of the electronic drum set, most of those challenges can be overcome. The drum set can be thought of as a collection of drums and cymbals that are configured so that one person can play them. But for the purpose of drum set therapy, you should think of them as, in the case of this $500 unit, as a collection of eight separate instruments. And because these are modules, you can actually have eight separate students play these at one time. And this is just scratching the surface on the potential of using electronic drums, which we'll cover more in detail in future lessons.